Let us name this given algin when two substituents are present. We are to name this given algin in the UPAC system. The first step that we have to do is identify the longest carbon chain. So this is the one. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So it must be pentane. After that, number the carbon atoms in the longest carbon chain. So it doesn't matter whether you start from left to right or from right to left because if you start from here also 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 again if you start from here also 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 that is if we number from left to right then this methyl group will be at position 2 and if we count from right to left it will be at position 4 the same thing for this one too okay so there are two methyl groups or substituents. Then the, how to name this one? Two and four. Two and four. Write first the positions of the two substituents. Two comma four hyphen. How many methyl groups are there? Two. So di methyl pentin. Okay, if it is 3, then use dry and so on. And if you are given an algene where the two substituents are attached to the same carbon atom, then how to name this one in the UPAC system? Okay, let us have a look. Identify the longest carbon chain, this one. It is propane. Second step. In the second step, we number the carbon atoms. There is no harm in numbering from left to right or from right to left because even if we do both sides, then I mean both ways, then this carbon to which the two substituents are attached is at second position only. Then how to name this given algin? Write the positions. Two, two, how many methyl groups? Two. Di, methyl propane 